What is going on guys? Kevin over at Legros coming back to you with another video today and today is something special. Uh, over a year ago, I had a person contact me and want me to, to buy his collection uh, and that video series was titled the most amazing collection, I think, with most capitalized. <laughs> I probably used that title twice or something, I don't know. But it was like four videos, and then there was a follow-up video a couple weeks later about some more stuff that he had. Out of the blue, he contacted me again, and he had more stuff. This was the guy who had the Chrome Vader and all the really, really, really cool, hard-to-find minifigures. He had... Some more stuff. This box is huge. It's not going to fit under the camera. Uh, but uh, we got some figures, boys. <laughs> he had some more stuff, and I bought it immediately. Uh, there were some sets on here as well that I don't usually do sets anymore. I kind of got out of use sets. But from this guy, I will make an exception because of the fact that all of his stuff is such... It's is so well taken care of and stuff like that. So shout out to you. Uh, you know who you are. If you're watching this, I'm not 100% sure. But let's take a look and see what sets we got. Uh, we can try to match up the bags, but the bags kind of look like this. So, um, you know, it's not really much to look at uh, when, you, when you go through there. That looks like a slave one to me. Uh, that's what the bags look like. Let me just double check what's in this box itself. Uh, oh, there's another bag. Is this another bag of minifigures? What is this? Ah, this is another bag of minifigures. So two bags of minifigures, and then uh, some sets in here. Of course, tons and tons and tons of bubble wrap, which is much appreciated. Let's take a look and see what we got. Uh, we got both versions of the Phantom, it looks like. Uh, I don't think all the minifigures from all of these sets were included. I, I probably bought them from the other previous videos. Uh, we also do have the, uh, what is this called? This was the Sith Infiltrator, I believe, right? 9500, zero, zero. that's the one with Darth Malgus. Uh, let me just double check on that. Uh, it sounds, sounds right, but it also sounds wrong to me. <laughs> so let's just take a look, shall we? Very quick. Okay, yeah, accept the cookies, okay? Jeez, just give, me, give it a break, all right, Bricklink? Just give it, give it a solid break. Oh, God, yeah. Well, sit, what did I say? I said Sith Infiltrator. That's Darth Maul's. Uh, this one is the Sith Fury Class Interceptor. My bad. Never had this set, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> all, I ever, all I ever get is Darth Maul, so, uh, yeah, you know, that's that. Uh, of course, you guys recognize what this one is. This is the Ghost, so that's also in there. And then we also have the 20th Anniversary Slave 1, of course. So this one might be the one that was called Boba Fett's what, Starship or something like that? Uh, and then we have the new ATT uh, with our friend, the Phase 2 Commander Cody, of which I've never never bought that either. Really, really don't like this book art. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Just don't like it. So those sets are included in there as well. They should be 100% complete, minus probably minifigures. Uh, but some of the minifigures are probably in here as well. So let's get through this. Uh, this looks like probably the expensive boys. <laughs> so it's a smaller bag. Uh, so we're going to leave that for last, of course. But there's some good stuff in here, I'm sure, as well. As we know from this particular collector, boy, did he have an eye on things. I tell you what, some people just get it. Some people just know what to get, and then they get it. And then they take care of it, and it's just that much better. Woo! I'm excited for all this. <laughs> Smash that like button, stores.ebay.com slash legbros, or on Whatnot. You can use that link for $10 off if you've never used Whatnot before. Doing some fun stuff over there. We're back on eBay, boys. We uh, I, I took a little break from eBay kind of to get into the Whatnot groove, but uh, we're back on eBay and we're on Whatnot, so we're full-time right now. We're just cranking on all cylinders and it's, it's fun. I took a little break uh, from Whatnot and then now I'm back, but... Uh, we're having some fun on both both platforms. But eBay is rebuilt now, so we're good. <laughs> uh, first off, we're starting with an ARF clone. Uh, there's just a standard clone. So this is a lot of just really good clones. <laughs> this is from me. <laughs> oh, he bought something from me. <laughs> and I bought it back. Full circle. Holy, he didn't even take it out of the bag. <laughs> that is just funny. Okay, full circle. That's my handwriting. So uh, that's that's hilarious. 
Full circle clones. Uh, that was two clone captains. We do have, this is pretty much all Ting, so I don't even know if we're gonna have a Ting pile. Maybe we'll save that for the uh, the other bag. Uh, Utapau clone, of course, fantastic. These are from the new uh, set, the new 212th. Uh, they still call them 212ths. Uh, the new ATT, I should say. There's a jetpack trooper. I wonder how much, I, I didn't know he bought stuff from me. <laughs> Usernames always make things difficult. Uh, there's the Printed Legs clone. Those are, of course, fantastic. The new Phase 2 Gunner, one of the new pilot. It's it's a pilot, right? And it's also just like the uh, Inspector Gadget of clones. He can be anything you want. There's our Phase 2 Cody, which I have never gotten before. Unfortunately, Phase 2 Cody's value got absolutely decimated by that rogue Mexico factory, which is very, very uh, unfortunate because that could have been a cool figure. But, you know, that's that's the world we live in today. Some 501st here as well. Ooh, this is the new 501st. I don't know why he's getting rid of this kind of stuff. It's like brand new, uh, which I haven't gotten any of this stuff. So that's kind of cool. Some more 501st, more 501st. There's a special forces trooper with his shield and his pauldron, of course. Uh, I guess that's our first one we'll put down here. We could probably put phase two Cody. I don't even know what his value is anymore though. Like, is he truly, is he even worth anything anymore? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, V-Wing, there's another 501st. We have our... Uh, clone Sergeant. Our 187th, I think is what those guys are, the purple ones, the Mace Windu ones. We have Wrecker from the Bad Batch, and what is that, Hunter from the Bad Batch, and Tech from the Bad Batch, and also... That, that looks like Bad Batch as well, but is it Echo? I don't know. No, this is Echo, right? That's Echo. Wait, who am I missing? Which one of the bad batches I'm missing? Oh, is this crosshair? This cro that must be crosshair then. Okay, crosshair. Yeah, he's got the like long rifle. That would make sense. All right, so all the bad batches in there. Uh, crisis averted. <laughs> we do have Jags pilot, uh, a bomb squad. Uh, I don't remember what that guy was in. He was in something. He's a, it's a good pilot though. Uh, there's Jag, I believe, is what that one is. We have Commander Cody, of course, with all of his armor that's going there. Oh, oh, no, oh, that one looks. That one looks pretty neat. We might have to unbag that one. That one wasn't in the other bag? Oh dear. Oh dear. Well, haven't got one of those boys in a long time, that's for sure. Yikes. Shadow ARF. Hello, Dolly. <laughs> that is that is a massive, massive ting at this point in time. Uh here is our uh Original clone, original clone. We got the uh, clone captain from the gunship, 75021. Here's our ARF, red ARF. There's our Kashyyyk. I don't even think we could put Kashyyyk up here, to be honest, for what's coming. Uh, ooh, you're excited now, aren't you? <laughs> There's another one of the new 212s. Yellow markings episode, three trooper. Some more bomb squad, another 187th, more 501st. Horn Company, we got all the clones. What what kind of clone you want? We just found it all. Uh, there's a pilot. He's not supposed to have a black head. That's interesting. Uh, there's a gunner. Ooh, phase two boy right there. Phase two boy right there. Original 501st. Ooh, that one's good. Look at that. That's a yellow markings clone with the pauldron. Yes, please. Uh, Utapau, we just still got to put Utapau down there. It's just so good. Geonosis, we got Jack, of course. Fantastic there as well. I'm going to have to clean off this ting pile. I don't even know. Uh, clone Lieutenant. Fantastic. Another pilot. Also fantastic. If you guys know, you know. This one's a little dirty, unfortunately. This has been sun damaged, but that's a recon scout. Uh, we do have a... What is this one? Geonosis? Geonosis guy. Um, just two more clones. Episode 3 Bomb Squad. Uh, we got another trooper right there. We got uh, Recon Scout, Phase 2 Gree, yeah. Uh, oh, there's another one of those uh, Episode 2 boys right there. Uh, Commander Neo, or Bark Trooper, as some people would like to say. Uh, there's the original yellow Utapau before the before the battle pack, right? Is what that one came out with. Uh, here is Gregor, Wolf, and Rex in their old forms. Gregor probably... Gregor and Wolf really aren't super fantastic. Rex is the one people want out of that one. Uh, we do have another... <laughs> the, the original version of the yellow do-all pilot. 
<laughs> clone. He's definitely better uh, than the other one. There's another episode three uh, green markings, about 75 bucks right there. And boom, my favorite figure from Star Wars of all time, Kashyyyk Scout Trooper right there. We do have another green. Ahsoka clone is what we'll call that one. There's a wolf pack just laying there. Why not? The original phase two gunner. We have another yellow markings episode three. Of course, what is it without Rex? <laughs> and Wolf. Uh, and Jack. Mm -hmm. uh, you see where I'm going with this? We haven't even opened the expensive bag yet. There's Fox. Yep, got them all. There's the 501st pilot. There's a Wolf Pack. Oh, dear. Uh, that's Oh, that's the new version of the Airborne uh, Utapal troops right there. We have a Episode 2 or sorry, episode two, phase two shock trooper. Yes, please. Oh yeah, that's a that's a phase two Rex. Uh huh. And uh, let's go ahead and go with uh, special forces and another 187th to round that out. We got another bag, folks. If that wasn't enough for you, we got another bag, folks. Oh, Dolly. <laughs> oh my God. Woo. These ones are fun. These ones are just plain fun. I like these. I don't have to put these together. They're already put together. What are we going to do? We can't drag these off. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. We'll just try to separate it a little bit. Oh, boy. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> All right. Well, let's start off with the uh, the white prototype Django. Uh, sorry, Boba. White to prototype Boba Fett. That one's about $50 at current market pricing. Uh, there's the new Mace Windu. Not sure. So I guess it wasn't just... It was basically was just troopers versus not troopers. It looks like it's already separated us. Maybe not just expensive. Uh, we have Chopper, of course, and our friend Ezra with his helmet. Ting, 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 ting. We have Harrison Dula, who's come down a little bit in price. She was a little bit crazy there for a second, but uh, come down a little bit in price there. Uh, ooh, Omega, or Omega, or Omega, or <laughs> however you want to say it. I don't even remember what she comes with uh, in terms of set, but I have never gotten that one before. So that's one of the newer ones I haven't gotten before. We have Zeb, of course, because what other rare figs could you possibly need? Uh, we have Callus with his helmet, because what else would you possibly need? Hello! Both hairs for some reason, which I'm not sure why. But that is Sabine, wrong, I think this is the wrong torso for that, right? Is this, is this the one that has the helmet? I always get confused. I thought the uh, the, the blank arm one had the helmet. Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, Sabine with the helmet. Thank you very much. What else could we need? Possibly maybe just a uh, old school Django Fett? Yeah, possibly just need that. Okay, fine. We'll take that. <laughs> I'll take that. Uh, oh, oh, this is a, this is just a Django Fett, right? No, no, that's the angry one. <laughs> that's the angry one. Good Lord, what is not in here? Oh my God, there's just a Sith, Sith Trooper. Just take you down just a little bit. We'll take you down a little bit before we put you back. <laughs> before we get you back up there. Uh, and we're right back. Here is young Boba going with that Django Fett. Oh, yeah, there's the other prototype, Boba Fett, because that's what we were missing from the first time, right? Uh-huh. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, I forgot. There's another really, really expensive fig, the Slave One version of printed legs, printed, sorry, printed legs and printed arms, Boba Fett from his UCS Slave One. Whew, all right, here's a Mandalorian. That'll take you down. Death Watch Mandalorian. Here's the new version of Boba Fett. Nothing much there. There's the Loyalist. Could have been a good fig, but uh, they made it in that foil pack. We also do have Bo-Katan and a uh, Battle battle Pack uh, Mandalorian, along with these three are Battle Pack Mandalorians. Uh, Republic Shock. Is that Republic or Imperial Shock? I never remember. Uh, we have Gar Saxon, which is a fantastic fig that is rising in value at the moment. Our bounty hunter as well. Here's just the regular Django Fett. You know, <laughs> regular old, you know, $50 Django Fett. <laughs> just, we'll, we'll take it. We'll take it. Uh, there's our Death Watch Mando right there. Here is our Kanan Jarrus. Unfortunately, he does not have black hair. That would have been that would have been a video, right? Uh, but we do have the blind version of him as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Darth Malgus to go along with his, uh, <laughs> with his interceptor there. Uh-huh. And we got that guy. There's another Boba Fett right there. 
Here is the rare version of Young Boba that came with the uh, hyperdrive set, the one that everybody's looking for. We do have the armor here as well. Pre Vizsla as well, because why not, right? We're just making the checklist. If we're doing the checklist, you thought that was a Cloud City Boba, didn't you? <laughs> At this point, I don't blame you. You thought that was a Cloud City Boba Fett. That is Old Grey's uh, Boba Fett right there. We do have the Mandalorian, another Sith Trooper, another Mandalorian. We have uh, Paz Vizsla right there. And then the Mandalorian with Child in Backpack right there. Or Front Pack, I guess you could say, is what that one is. Front Pack. Uh, this one's all right, right? You guys, you guys like any of this stuff? Uh, I know you can't see any of it on screen, but... Um, Comment below your favorite? Uh, I don't know what to say at this point. That's, uh, there, what else do I show you anymore? I don't know if there's any reason to watch my channel because we just found all of it. So uh, I'll be here. Uh, if you want any of this stuff, uh, I know a guy. <laughs> oh, love you guys. What a moment. How epic. I can't. Pick. I can't pick. What am I supposed to pick? I've never had this guy, I don't think. Possibly. I might have. Yeah, I've had him before. But I don't really ever have that guy. So let's go with that guy is the favorite, right? That works. That works. Good lord, the value. The value is just insane. Even the sets were great. Even the sets were great. I love you guys. Thank you very much for tuning in. Hopefully you guys are still having a blast. We're almost at 30,000 subs, uh, which is just a crazy thing to think about. When we started, at there was there was none of this coming in. Uh, there was like, you know, random brick and minifig halls coming in, and it was just, you know, I was brand new little baby and cringe as all get out. I mean, I'm still cringe as all get out. Don't get me wrong. I still get those comments about people who hate me saying woo and you know, all those kind of things. But uh, I'm glad that uh, you guys are still here. I'm glad that you're having fun. I'm glad that I can continue doing this, especially on a full-time basis now. And it's all thanks to you guys. I definitely 100% appreciate all of you out there who still watch these videos and get some enjoyment out of it. Sharing the experience of coming from zero and making a business has been monumental. It's just been so fun. Uh, and I'm glad you guys have come along for the ride. Hopefully you guys have a great rest of your day. Do something you love and you'll never work a day in your life. I'll catch you on the next one.